and welcome to the Fox 44 Kids Club Show. I'm so glad you're with us this morning. I'm Beth Ann Patmethis. I'm the host of 44 Main Street, but today the Fox 44 Kids Club is taking our time slot. This is a lot of fun. We always have a lot of fun on this show. It's real important for you right now to call your friends and tell them the Fox 44 Kids Club Show is on the air. We have all kinds of things planned today. In just a moment, we'll be giving you details on how you can become an actor or an actress. We have an actor and an actress here they're going to tell us how they actually got to be what they are also on our program today you will meet Brody he's a drug sniffing dog he works for the police department he's just beautiful so stay tuned for that also you'll meet some safety patrol officers and fire wardens who are your age and you'll meet the new kid hosts of the Fox 44 Kids Club so stay tuned for that their names are Abby and Jared you'll want to meet them for sure moving on to our first topic today joining me now to talk about how you can become an actor or an actress, the gentleman on my right, this is Dwayne Parks. He is the director, one of the co-directors, I should say, of Totally New Theater here in Evansville. And on my left, this is Casey Rickard and Cheryl Sanders. Like I said, they are actors and actresses. Good morning. Welcome. Hi. Good morning. How are you? Fine. Mm -hmm. uh, you both have been on the stage many times, is that right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, you just finished a show called? Sticks. At Totally New Theater? Uh-huh. How were the auditions? Were they tough? Well, there was a lot of kids there. Mm -hmm. um, was it a musical? Yeah, all of the shows have musicals in them. Mm -hmm. And acting, singing, dancing. Everything. Is it hard to be an actress? Do you have to memorize a lot of lines? Yeah, but if you just have the confidence, then you can mm -hmm. really understand the lines and understand your character more. Mm -hmm. Casey, you've been an actor for quite a while, haven't you? Yeah. Uh, is it hard for you to learn lines? Sometimes it's pretty difficult, but most of the time it's pretty easy. You get used to it after a while. Do your mom and dad, do they help you out? And sometimes. I mostly do it on my own in my room. Mm -hmm. All right, Duane, it's your turn to tell us all about Totally New Theater and how kids like this can be in place at your place. Well, um, we've been here in Evansville now for a year, um, me and my co-director, Jay Nagel. Um, we're in the old courthouse downtown, and we hold auditions and do shows once a month, basically. Um, they're always musicals. We write all of our own material. Um, the kids come in and audition. We hold open auditions uh, approximately every six weeks. They're always posted in some type of media. You are very um, busy. Yeah, constantly, constantly busy. Um, and they just come in. We hold auditions. We go through. We see who's best for what part and put it together. Where do you get the inspiration for your writing, then, if you're writing so many musicals? Um, it comes from all kinds of different past experiences, I think. Um, uh, the show that we got coming up in January, The Tale of Tyler T., is a country western rock musical, which um, <laughs> it's, uh, got a, it's about a boy from Texas who's a country and western singer, and he goes to New York and runs into these rock and rollers. So it's kind of a clash of both. Should children go in for training? Um, it can help, it can help, but uh, we take and start from the ground up and work our way up with them. Mm -hmm. And with each show, uh, they get a lot more experience. Mm -hmm. Did you guys go through acting classes at all? No. no. Mm -hmm. So you're just naturals, huh? <laughs> I started off dancing in the first play, then I just kind of took different steps up. It's really helped you to be more confident, hasn't it? Mm -hmm. What about school plays? Are you doing anything at school? Coming up in like the spring, the fifth grade always puts on plays. And my teacher is normally the director of them. And so I keep her informed of all the plays that we do here. Uh, what TNT. do your friends think about uh, you guys being actors, huh? They just, they always want to know when stuff is. Uh, that's nice then that they'll come and see you, huh? Yeah. And how about you, Casey? Well, uh, right now, I'm involved in a school play. It's called Funky Winker Beans Homecoming. I, I play That's the, a strange title, isn't it? <laughs> it's from the comic strip of the Sunday paper. Uh, oh, yeah, Funky Winker Beans. That's right. He's a high schooler, right? Yeah. Is that right? Okay. And I play the character of the football coach, mm -hmm. <laughs> which that, that's kind of weird because... Uh-huh. Did you audition for um, the Tales of Tyler T? No. Did you audition for that? Yeah, but it it sounds like more only mainly for teens and stuff. So 
I take dance lessons, so I just tried out for dancing. Mm. Well, that's good, too. It keeps yeah. you active, right? Um, the kids that are going to be in your new production of the Tales of Tyler T, who are they? And, um, uh, a lot of them are around the ages of 15 to 20, um, a lot of older high school kids. Um, some from Central, some of our kids that's been around for a while are coming back to do this show that hasn't done the last couple of shows. Um, uh, we've got some new faces that came in this time. So. And you're always looking for new faces, aren't you? Always looking for new faces. And see, if you yeah. guys can do it, anybody can, huh? If you would like to be an actor, an actress, you can call Totally New Theater and they will give you some details. Here's their phone number, 423-4506. 423-4506. Make sure you write it down and tell your mom and dad that you would like to inquire about how you can become an actor. When we come back in just a moment, you will meet Officer Robbie Hahn from the Evansville Police Department and his dog Brody. We'll be back in just a moment. Thanks a lot for being here.